hujambo natumai malipopote ambapo unanitazamia huko boheri wa afya i really do appreciate you guys ambao mna come mna return kwa channel ku watch new videos kama ni mara yako ya kwanza umejipata katika channel hii nitakusihi tafadhali uweze kufinya hiyo subscribe na ufinye hiyo notification bell ndio niki upload another video unakuwa amongst the first people to be notified mambo ambayo haufai ufanye kwa bed wakati mnachapana kuni we kama deo ninasema wanawake mambo ambayo haupaswi kufanya wakati mnachapana kuni Nelewa. Kuna yale mambo ambayo unaweza kuwa unafanya bila ya kutarajia ama unknowingly and it turns out kuwa ina turn off your man ama ina inasababisha mwanaume anapotea kwa ajili ya yale, yale mambo ambayo unaweza kuwa ulifanya bila ya kujua. Jambo la kwanza ambalo haufai ufanye wakati unachapana kuni. Kuna wale wanadada ambao muko na tabia ya kuitisha do jamaa kitu iko ndani anakugonga yeye yeah, ako busy anajaribu concentrate on how to make you happy on how to satisfy you on what styles or what point anaweza kukuhit kuku ama anaweza kukunak ndio uweze kufika mwisho ama kufika kileleni lakini wewe akili yako iko kwa how much i need this you promised me this my sister any promise that a man gives you while he's naked never take it serious anakupatia hiyo promise so that itakuwa easy kwa wewe kufungua miguu never take any promise made by a naked man seriously point number 2 bad smell harufu mbaya harufu mbaya nikisema harufu mbaya ina include kuna wale wanadada wananuka nunu kuna wale wenye wananuka mdomo kuna wale wako na harufu pale chini ya nyonyo usafi ni muhimu alafu not forgetting wig mtu umeshona kichwa umesweat umefanya nini umefanya nini imefika mahali kichwa kinaanza kunuka mazee unaachilia nywele unakaa na wig like a whole month two month eh, because it was expensive kunyoa si expensive and it's very clean na inuki sijui kama unanipata hiyo harufu peke yake itakusababisha huyo mtu wako ama huyo mwanaume akue na akili zingine kando kando na nikisema akili zingine kando kando na maanisha mipango za kando point number three kuna wale wanadada ambao wanashtukia kama pupu imetoka <laughs> wanashtukia kama imetoka yani kwa sababu ya ile raha alikuwa anapata ama kwa ule utamu alikuwa anahisi so akashindwa kujicontrol na ikatoka kuna wale wanaume ambao hawaelewi kuna wale ambao wanaelewa Naona but sasa unfortunately wenye hawaelewi ndio wengi majambazi ambao hawaelewi ambao hawatambui kuwa kunaweza kuwa na situation kama hiyo ndio wengi so it's good ku communicate na mtu wako umwambie mimi kishafika na raha ni utamu umezidi huwa kuna kitu fulani huwa inatendeka communication is always important <laughs> Point number four, keeping quiet. Kuna wale ambao wananyamaza tu kuchapana kuni mwanzo kutoka mwanzo mpaka mwisho umenyamaza you are just silent. Kuna wanaume ambao hawatafurahia and you know when you keep moaning when you keep producing that sound it actually makes your man even more hard and it makes him <coughs> anazidi kufanya yale mambo ambayo alikuwa anafanya. Lakini ukikeep quiet Umenyamaza tu. Huyo jamaa atashindwa kuelewa. Are you enjoying? Are you feeling anything or he is just wasting his time? Umenipata. Point number five. Do not get dry. When you get dry during sex. Hiyo ni mbinu moja ama hiyo ni moja wapo ya mwanaume kuboeka na nuno yako sababu the dry, when you become dry it becomes um, in a in a later in a friction now when it friction ikizidi kuna blisters 
na hiyo blister zikitokea inamaanisha huyu jamaa hatataka na hata we mwanadada pia hautatamani kuchapwa kuni na huyo msee sababu ama hata na msee mwingine sababu ya ile friction naelewa so when there is friction there is no enjoyment so avoid getting dry and how do you avoid getting dry by making sure akili zako ziko pale ume concentrate na ume una communicate na huyu jamaa kuwa anafaa aendelee kukushika sehemu fulani sehemu fulani kukudara umkiendelea kuchapana kwenu maelewa ah alafu point number six not positioning yourself well kuna wale wenye umejiweka tu bora ingi unajua sasa inaweza sababisha huyu mwanaume akashindwa kukua na ile stamina ama akashindwa ku, 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 kupiga miti poa kwa sababu ya ile position ambayo umejiweka umejiweka kwa kona na anajaribu kukuweka hii side hautaki wewe unataka kuwe kwa position yenye wewe comfortable peke yako na huyu mwingine haujali maslahi yake yani haujali hisia zake haujali yana kama position gani na hiyo hizo position zinaweza mfanya akachoka kwa haraka na akapoweka kwa sababu wewe zi you are not participating unaelewa you are just there to enjoy yourself but not to make the two of you enjoy each other point number seven, asking him to stop unataka kwenda kususu <laughs> Kuna wale wanadada ambao hawatambui kusquat ni nini na kuna wanaume pia ambao hawajui kusquat ni nini. Mm. So kuna ule mwanaume ambaye ataambiwa stop nataka kwenda kususu na ana stop anamwambia enda ususu we ni fala. Alafu na yule mwanadada ambaye unawika ama unasukuma mtu ama unaambia mwanaume stop I want to go and ususu ama nataka kwenda ususu ama nasikia mkojo unakuja. My sister. Hiyo ndio inaitwa kusquat wewe ajilia na wewe mwanaume pia mpatie ile affirmation mpatie ile assurance mweke in that uh, in that confidence zone yenye uachilia wewe acha itoke hii tutaosha ama ni ile tu unampatia ile freedom Hmm. aeke akili yake pale asianze kukana ile uoga ama asiogope sababu akizuia na wewe uendelee ika aka akose kuachilia hapo ndio unapata mwanadada anaanza kulalamika kuwa baada ya kupigana kuni anaanza kusikia uchungu kwa abdomen ama kwa kwa, kwa ile urethra sababu alizuia the oh, ejaculation unaelewa alizuia ejaculating ama ejaculation so any moment any time unasikia unasikia kama una pressure imezidi unataka kususue kama demo acha kusema unataka kususua kuna mtu mwana anasusu wakati unachapana kuni ni kitu kinaitwa ejaculation which is kusquat okay yes point number <laughs> point number 8 kuna wale kuna wale wanadada ambao ukiweka doggy style wananyamba inaitwa kufat mm. kwa sababu ya ile raha ambayo anapata itategemea na yule mwanaume ambaye uko na yeye sababu kuna wale wanaume they don't understand kuwa mtu anaweza akaproduce a certain sound kwa sababu ya kupata ile raha kwa sababu ya kushindwa kujicontrol kwa sababu ya utamu sasa mwanaume kuna, kuna wale wanaume ambao akisikia kitu kama hiyo anaboeka na hata unaweza mkaachana kwa sababu ya kitu kidogo kama hicho. So kama mwanadada unahisi ama unajitambua, unajitambua huko na situation kama hizo. Communication is always important. Mwambie mtu wako mimi niko hivi niko hivi, ukisikia kitu kama hiki kitendeka just know I'm enjoying the game. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling good. Siju kama tuko pamoja. Point number nine squatting without information kuna wale wadeo wenye wanajijua wanajijua hao ni wale watu wa kusquat wanakojoa kukojoa and when they do that wana, wanaweza wakasababisha malazi kakuwa maji the whole bed yani the whole mattress the whole sheet 
uh, kama ni kwa ground ground na kani kama maji yani maji yamemwagika kuna wale madema ambao wanajitambua it's good to communicate it's good to tell your partner kuwa mimi nina squat ile noma so that your man is anaji prepare psychologically anaji prepare mentally so and anakuwa ready and being ready means mnafaa mnatandika pale kwa ile malazi kuna zile bed covers ambazo zinakaa nylon lakini si nylon unalewa zinazuia ya itazuia ule mkojo ama ile kusquat isiingie kwenye mattress ibaki tu kule pale kwa ile ile bed cover sio kama tuko pamoja so communication is always important communication is always important if you don't communicate to your person alafu ukuje mchafulie malazi ukuje mkojolee malazi ukuje mfanyie nini pale ukichafua tu vitu ovyo ovyo hiyo inaweza kuwa ni mara yenu ya mwisho na atakuchukia bure na hata anaweza kukutangaza ovyo ovyo so make sure you communicate to your partner hata wewe mwanaume unafaa una communicate na na demu yako lakini kwa hii ninazungumza na wanadada mambo ambayo haifai umfanyie mwanaume ama haifai ufanye wakati mnachapana kuni point number 10 not showing a sign of enjoying you are not showing any sign any signal that you are actually enjoying the knocking hiyo itamfanya mwanaume ashangae what is really going on here itampoteza itafanya mwanaume na morali yake na rudi down kwa sababu haoni ni nini anafanya hajui ni nini inaendelea just because you are not showing any sign jaribu kukuwa creative produce some sounds make him feel that he is actually doing something make him feel that you are feeling him point number 11 receiving calls during sex <laughs> kuna wale wana kuna wale wana dada ambao mnachapana kuni mnachapana kuni ndio hiyo game enjoy game iko tu fit ina bamba ndio ina inafika ndio inafika inaelekea kufika climax huyu anachukua simu inaitana anachukua can you imagine kama wewe ndio ndio mwanaume sasa unapiga kuni alafu una mtu anapigiwa simu anachukua it that actually means kuwa huyo mtu hayuko hapo yeye yako kwa biashara nyingine tofauti na wewe unless mko katika biashara yenyewe umemlipa umpige kuni alafu wewe uende zako that is business but if it's something that is in between the two of you you are actually there to enjoy you are there to make love not to have sex do not receive calls during sex don't receive don't even chat don't even text keep it keep, keep the phone in the silent mode keep your phone away when it's time for knocking let it remain time for knocking then point number 12 stick to one style yani you are just wewe ni ule mtu style moja ni missionary kutoka Mwanze mpaka mumalize wewe uko tu kwa missionary pia hiyo itafanya mwanaume apoeke na wewe sababu labda ni mwanaume ambaye ame explore mwanaume ambaye anaelewa different style lakini anajaribu kuweka kwa hii umeanza kuguruma anakuweka kwa hii unazusha anakuweka kwa hii nyingine unakataa itamfanya atafute mtu ambaye anaweza cheza hiyo style ambayo we utaki alafu wewe utakuwa kwanza kwani wanaume wanataka nini wanataka ile kitu yenye wao wamekataa kuwapatia. I love the last point. Switching off the lights. Like for example, me you switch off the light, we switch I switch off. You switch on the light, I switch on because uh, I cannot eat food in the dark. Sijui kama unanipata. Hakuna chakula ambacho kinaliwa kwa giza. Unakula aje chakula kwa giza. Inakuwaaje kuaje see you in my next video thanks for watching kama ni mara yako ya kwanza kindly subscribe liking sharing commenting it's absolutely free piga hiki tumbaka itoe moshi kwani iko nini